Here's how to use Digital Scorebook to live score a basketball game. Digital Scorebook by SB Live is the best way to live score basketball games and give your fans an awesome, immersive experience. If you have a trusted scorekeeper, live scoring your games is a great way to keep your fans engaged when they can't be at the game in person, and it saves you time post-game by eliminating the need to manually submit your final score. To use Digital Scorebook, you must first be the owner of a school or team, or have been invited by a school or team owner to help manage a team. If you've already created an account in Game Day or on scorebooklive.com and gained access to manage your school or team, just sign into your account and you'll be ready to start using the app. If you haven't claimed your school or teams yet, download the Game Day app and sign up for an account. Once you've created your account and claimed your school or teams, head back to Digital Scorebook to score your game. First, select the game you want to score. The pre-game hub gives you a chance to make any last-minute updates to the game information. Next, make sure the rosters are correct for both your team and your opponent. If you need to add a player to either team, you'll be able to do that here. Once the rosters are up to date, you'll be ready to start the scoring. To start the game, tap the Start Game button and select which team won the tip. Based on your selection, Digital Scorebook will automatically set the possession arrow for you. Before we start scoring the game, let's take a minute to understand the main scoring screen. The teams are represented on each side by their team colors. To switch from one team to the other, simply tap on the team you will be adding a point, foul, or timeout for. The plus two, plus three, or free throw buttons allow you to update the score. At any point in the game, you can edit or undo an event and even share a game update to your social media accounts. The bottom half of the screen allows you to view the rosters for each team as well as quarter by quarter and total stats for each player. To record a made field goal, tap the plus two or plus three button for the corresponding team and select which player scored. To record made or missed free throws, tap on the free throw button, select the player at the line, as well as the number of shots he or she will be attempting. Record each shot as a make or miss and tap OK to return to the main scoring screen. To record a foul, tap on the team fouls button, designate the type of foul, and select which player committed the foul. Digital Scorebook automatically tracks team fouls and personal fouls based on your input and will disqualify a player after they reach the foul limit. To record a timeout, tap the Timeout button and select the type of timeout as well as the time on the game clock. Digital Scorebook automatically tracks the number of remaining timeouts for each team based on your input and will alert you when a team has reached the limit. You're also able to update the time remaining in each quarter to help your fans following along online. To do this, just tap the time remaining under Minutes Left. If at any point you make a mistake, click the Edit History button. Here, you can edit plays by changing the player involved or the type of event. You can also delete events if necessary. To advance to the next quarter, tap the Advanced Quarter button at the top of the screen and select OK. To end the game, just tap the Advanced Quarter button in the fourth quarter and select the End Game option. Remember, this action can't be undone. Once the game is ended, the post-game hub allows you to review and edit plays from the game, edit or export stats, share a final game update to social media, and even add your own commentary to the game recap story. When you're finished, tap Done in the upper right corner to return to the game list. As always, if you have any questions about what we covered in this video or anything else, contact us at support at scorebooklive.com and we'll lend you a hand.